Hi, I'm Tornikem. I was a member of Georgia Youth Bank, specifically in Marneuli since 2011. Obviously, from the beginning, I didn't know what it was a youth bank about. I thought it was just a camp. And I was looking forward to those uh, training opportunities to develop my skills. Eventually, I ended up being with youth bank for 12 years now. And um, quite frankly, it gave me way more than I thought initially that youth bank would give. First of all, it's not only the trainings or developing the skills, but it was a huge network that I built throughout those years across different countries and different regions of Georgia. Being a trainer in Georgian Youth Bank changed my life and perspective in two directions. So the first of all, I saw the influence that I could have on the youth development and um, the example I could be for them to develop their career paths and go into the direction they always wanted to. Following being the trainer of the Georgian Youth Bank, I was actively involved in the youth conferences and youth summits. At the same time, I organized youth camps and I became really deeply involved in the youth empowerment and youth development. After graduating from the law school back in Georgia, I continued studies in Germany with the Master of Public Policy. Currently, I'm based in Frankfurt, uh, leading the team of 18 professionals in the Frankfurt Stock Exchange. And during this, my leadership journey as well, there were the cases where I, you know, suddenly realized that certain skills or certain competencies that I have developed over the years are coming from the youth bank, and that I can apply that in my current professional journey as well. Many young people think that they should be perfect in every sense to get the job. If I think about some of my other experiences, there was one of the program when I was in high school where I applied every year for three consecutive years where I wanted to be part of, but I got the rejections all the time. So it was demotivating, obviously, but now if I think about those experiences or those failures and the rejections, if I followed them, if I like would think about them and about those rejections consistently, I would never make it to the stage I am at the moment. So I decided to take that, you know, rejection somehow. Yeah, it was not easy, of course, I understand. But I had decided to move on and eventually life had better things for me. Having, you know, the highly developed skills and having the knowledges and competences is not essential to bring the impact and the change you desire in your local community. I think the crucial elements are motivation, are the growth mindsets and having the passion being the change.